it's, do you know, it's really significant because you've got 77 journalists voting for about 60, 65 cars. And do you know, this year it was fairly evident early on that the EV9 was really going to get out in front. But the fact that it came out strongly right from the get-go was just lovely because I think that it's the car that suits almost everyone. And that's probably why, in the end, that it won. First thing that I noticed was, you know, it, it's it's a three uh, three row seats. You know, it, that's very uh, rare in an EV. It's designed around uh, making it almost like your own personal living room, and I think that's nice. You feel at home. It's so spacious, and uh, of course, the exterior. That's definitely a plus point. I think in terms of the innovation, one of the things people really worry about is charging. And I think the ultra-fast charging mode of the EV9 is a huge plus for people who are worried about that. And the fact that you, I think you can, in 24 minutes, charge 80% of the car, now that's a game changer. I think the thing that is striking about it is that it's it has all the good parts about driving an EV, that instant acceleration and the quietness, but you don't think about the fact that you're driving an EV. It's still very easy to drive, even if you're used to driving cars powered by a gas engine. So it's a lovely car to drive. I think that women appreciate the Kia brand for delivering a lot of value. So you look at all the features, that display is very easy to view and it does give a certain high-tech feel. The only thing you have to get used to is how wonderfully quiet it is, um, but it delivers. It really is a wonderful SUV to drive. Kia. Movement that inspires.